It's the Jeffo and Show, the Jeffo and Show, starring Jeff. They sound very good, though. Proud. <laughs> Welcome back to the Jeff Irwin Show. I am your host, Jeff Irwin. Episode two. What? <laughs> Happy Fourth of July, people. Very excited. If you stay tuned to the end of the episode, there will be a special 4th of July tribute like you have never seen before. I promise, guy. Today's top story, Hong Kong. Beginning on June 9th, over 2 million people gathered in the streets of Hong Kong to protest a law that would allow Beijing to extradite Hong Kong citizens to China for crimes yielding a sentence greater than seven years. The concern, China would use this as an excuse to extradite political activists, or frankly, whomever they damn well please. <laughs> Dictatorships, right? This would effectively take the One Country, Two Systems Agreement and dissolve it into a steaming pile of smelly sewage. Democratically elected opposition lawmakers were unable to veto the bill because they were kicked out through court orders. At the time, Chief Executive of Hong Kong, Carrie Lam, said that she would press forward with the vote despite the millions of people clamoring for freedom in the streets. The protests raged through Wednesday when police used tear gas and rubber bullets on the crowds who defended themselves with umbrellas, gas masks, and sodium chloride to nullify the gas. As a result, on Saturday, June 15th, Carrie Lam suspended the vote indefinitely and apologized, accepting responsibility for the protests. For commentary, we go to our special correspondent, Hung, the Hong Kong Dragon. Hung. We winner, you loser. We winning, you losing. You try to take our rights away, but we take them back from you every day. We winner, you loser. Ha ha! <laughs> Catchy little ditty there, Hung. Thank you very much. I work very hardly on making a good song. I, I think you mean very hard. That's what I say, hardly. No, 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 you said... <laughs> very bad idea to correct Dragon JF. Got it. Good. So, are, are you done protesting? Psst, not even closely. We just get it started. Why is that? Carrie Lam need to step down. She pop up for Beijing. She tried very hard to get bill passed under our noses. She bear bad, and her choreography is terrible. Wasn't she elected by the people? By the people? Which people? You know how many Hong Kong people vote for Carrie Lam and her erection? <laughs> erection? <laughs> Careful, Jeff Lee. Uh, no, no, right. Um, how, how many? Less than 0.03% of Hong Kong people vote for her. That almost less the number of people who watch your pilot episode. Wow. Didn't know dragons could be so cold. <laughs> All right. So the protests? We keep protesting till Carrie Lam step down. She not democratically elected. She erected by public government where all locally erected people get forced out. That's not good. No, it very bad. She said indefinitely suspend extradition law, but that means she definitely bring it back when we know looking. But we always looking, Carrie Lam. We watching you. We protest. We make a fishball in street. Fishballs? You mean fish testicles? <laughs> Chung Wai Lao. You very stupid. Fish don't have a ball. We take a fish and make a fish ball like a meatball, but a fish ball. Fish balls. Fish ball very good for you. Fish ball have many nutritional benefit. Vitamin, mineral, aphrodisiac. I'll have to try some sometime. You try some now. Okay. Delicious. <laughs> I tell you, now you go to turn into fish. Really? Chung Wai Lao, I just mess with you. You very fun to mess with. Ducky ducky ha ha. I'm glad I could amuse you. 
<laughs> All right, that's enough. Let's get back on track here. This past Monday, another swarm of protesters stormed the city's legislature building, breaking windows and just generally trashing the place. What's your take here, Hung? Violence a bear bad. <laughs> really? Bad for people, not for dragon. China no take the violence so good if you remember Tiananmen Square, and they were peaceful protests. Same time, Carrie Lam keeps saying she's going to conciliate and talking to people. She give a lip service, but doing no thing. So we keep a protest. Violence bad, protest good. Nice summation, hon. Out of curiosity, what would happen if this law does get passed? Psst. Very, very bad for Hong Kong people. Hong Kong's still a free. China no free. Hong Kong people who fight for freedom get extradited to China to go to China jail. You think America jail bad? China jail much worsely. China jail mostly forced to labor camp like a peeling garlic from dawn to dusk until fingernail melt. Ew. You trap in dark all day. No recess. They tortured you to confession. Food bad, everything very badly. Sounds awful. Cells are worse than your studio. Gee, thanks, Hung. Your studio very low rent. Hey, don't do that. Ha-ha! <laughs> you sound like a Luke Skywalker talking to Yoda in Empire Strike Backley. I do love that scene. You look like him a too. Luke? No, Yoda. Chung Wai Lao. Yes, you look like a Mark Hamily. Thanks, Dragon. But you just ruined the entire illusion here. Exactly. It's what I do. You need to upgrade. Tell me about it. Hey, can you uh, magically make me a new studio? <laughs> you very funny. <laughs> you ducky ducky. Okay, but you have to do thing for me, Lee. Okay, what can I do for you, dragon? I looking for a new mate. A new mate? Huh? You, um, you're the only dragon that I know. Yes, I know, Lee, but you friendly with a unicorn. I'm sorry. What? Are you a gay dragon? Silly man, dragon no have no gender, Lee. Really? We magic call. All right, no need to get testy. What happens if it doesn't go well? Oh, that very simply. I burn your whole studio down. Seriously? <laughs> I sure go fine. <laughs> Great. Tune in next week when uh, Hung, the Hong Kong dragon, meets William the Unicorn. Stay tuned for a 4th of July tribute. Welcome back to the Jeff Irwin Show. I'm here with... Jeff Irwin. Hey, Jeff. Hey, Jeff. I hear you got something special playing with that guitar. Little specialty Star Spangled Banner. So we dogger. Take it away, Jeff. Oh, who say can you see by the dawn's early light? Dawn very What's bright. So proudly we hail. We proud. At the twilight's last gleaming. Whose broad stripes and bright stars Very, very bright the perilous fight Fighting bad All the ramparts we watched Was so gallantly screaming And the rockets ran glad Rockets very cool The bombs bursting bombs in Bombs very bad eye. Gave proof through to the night, night. That our flag was still there. Ha. Oh, who said does that star spangled but not yet You sound very good, Jeff Lee. Oh, the land of the free. Freedom very important. And the home of the brave. Very, very, very brave. Happy birthday, America.